Hey guys, it's Rita. And today we're gonna make some fire ass salsa. Let's get to it. First off, I'm gonna start by roasting myself and then these fresh veggies. I can put these on first. We're gonna roast all the peppers today. Everything's getting roasted. Just in case we're gonna use it. I've got serrano peppers, jalapeno peppers, and a habanero pepper because spicy like tahini. Um, okay, now it's time to roast myself. Yeah. We're starting to roast. I don't know if you can see that, but spicy chili pepper. It's probably gonna take a little while, so we'll let that cook. So I got my tomatoes roasting over here. Jalapenos, serrano peppers, garlic. I almost forgot about that. Very important. Can't forget about the garlic. Um, peppers, onions. And let that all roast. Get all nice and toasty. It smells good. I know you guys wish you could smell through the camera, but you can't. <laughs> It's looking real good, real roasted, but I think it's shot o'clock. <laughs> Cheers. Hey, I feel like these are good now. I'm going to start by putting the garlic. I'm gonna start by mashing this up. We're gonna make like a garlic paste. Mash all of it in. Mmm, I don't know about you, but I love the smell of roasted garlic. Oh, it smells so good. I don't know, I hope that was enough garlic though. I don't know if you can see, but I have like a garlicky paste going on. In this. And I'm gonna go for my peppers next. Mm. I'm going to cut it up before I mash it up. Woo! Hot! 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 And because I also have the habanero and the serrano, I'm gonna find out how spicy the jalapeno pepper is. Because, I don't know if you heard about it, but jalapenos are like a box of chocolate either gonna get a spicy one or it's not gonna be spicy so I'm gonna say that one wasn't spicy so I'm gonna add serrano peppers as well we've got this one <clears throat> Woo, hot and you know I'm gonna be real honest I don't know if serrano peppers are spicy like that so. Oh, yeah, spicy, at least compared to the jalapeno pepper. I'm going to put three in there, but I might hold off on the habanero pepper. It's a good spice, but definitely it's spicy. Now I'm going to mash the peppers. <laughs> Out of the tomatoes, I ground up the onions with the garlic and the peppers all together. Next, I'm gonna add up the chopped up onions. Ooh, that was a juicy tomato. Filling up a mocajete. I'm going to add a lot of lime juice. Come on, for woo, squirted. I'm gonna get all that lime juice out of there. Number two. Ooh. Juicy limes. Don't have this part because the salt was supposed to go a lot earlier. Uh-uh. <laughs> two pinches of salt. That'll be good. 
I'm gonna add my chopped onions into the mocha head there. And I'm going to add the cilantro as well. I like a lot of cilantro. And along with the cilantro, I'm gonna add something very special today. You guys know what these are? <laughs> Let's see how these taste, actually. Kind of remind me of a shisho leaf. I'm gonna chop some of these up. And we're gonna put it in our salsa. Mix all of that up. I don't know, that looks pretty good to me. My perfect little garnish. Still a little warm, but if it was chilled, it'd be good. <laughs> I don't think it needs to be spicier. I mean, if it was me, I would. I like spicy. I don't know. Sorry. <laughs> We're gonna try our spicy salsa. Spicy? Yeah. <laughs> spicy? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I have a weedly. I chopped this up. You don't actually get high from eating this, but apparently you do get like the medical benefits. Look, you learn something new every day. Shout out to Vibe. Big joints only.